Hello, I'm Mark Savard, and welcome to a Motivational Minute. 60 seconds starts now. What is happiness? Well, it turns out it's not so easy to define. The Oxford English Dictionary tells us that happiness is the condition of being happy. Yeah, thanks for the help, guys. Luckily, science is hard at work, and there's a lot we can do to be happier. Across the board, studies show that the number one factor affecting people's reported happiness is not money, not love, not even sex, not even family and friends. It's purpose. The opposite of happiness is not unhappiness. It's apathy. The loss of joy that we feel when we aren't moving toward our potential can be devastating. But the converse is actually also true. Find a purpose and you find happiness. It's also important to note that no one is happy all the time, and that's okay. You usually hear people say that if we were happy all of the time, then we wouldn't appreciate the good times. But there's an evolutionary reason that constant happiness would be bad. You see, our brains are hardwired to focus on threats. This keeps us safe. It's not good to feel happy in a dark alley at night. So, well, the good news is that study after study shows that simply trying to be happier improves your outlook and your mood. Here are a few things you can do to get happy. Meditation, practicing gratitude, exercise, and even simply smiling are all proven ways to elevate your mood. Most importantly, over time, these small changes will create new pathways in the brain, and you might just find yourself becoming a whole lot happier overall. Be sure to tag someone who you think might enjoy this message. And let me know how you're doing. Like, comment, share, retweet, and or follow. See you next week. Remember, happiness is a journey, not a destination. Lock that into your mind.